Hello, I'm Richard Phobes, the bald explorer, and I'm out on another walk, and I'm with Harriet. Hello, Harriet. Hello. Good morning. <laughs> Good morning. And, uh, and Oh, yes, of course. <laughs> little Lola. Hello, little Lola. Ooh. Hello. Lola, say hello. <laughs> Harriet, where are we walking today? Richard, today we are somewhere called Rodney's Pillar. Oh yes, look, there's a sign just behind you. <laughs> there we go. How, how lucky is that? Lead. Oh no, dogs, sorry. Dogs. Oh, yes. Um, men folk can allow to roam free. So, uh, oh yes, we've got the old uh, kissing gate to go through. We're, um, where is, that's better, whereabouts is Rodney's Pillar, Harriet. That's a good question. It's, um, is it about 10 miles outside Shrewsbury, I suppose? Um, actually, in Wales. In Wales? So we're sort of mid... Are we're we in Powys? We're in Powys, yes, mid ah. Wales. On the way to somewhere very beautiful, which we must do one day, actually called Lake Burnwy. Oh, yeah. Which is amazing, but we'll save that for another day. Yeah, we've been to Lake Burnwy once before, hasn't it? And it's a giant, a giant uh, water reservoir. reservoir. Yes. yes. Yes, more than a lake. Um, it's, uh, it is raining today. It is, uh, <laughs> but hey ho. <laughs> We're going to do our best, come what may. Uh, this is somewhere I'm um, called the Crickion Estate, so it's permissive walking. Um, and there is something, well I'm sure you'll tell your viewers, at the top called Rodney's Pillar. And it's quite a long schlep up. <laughs> yes, fortunately for us, and the reason that we've chosen this today, um, as opposed to perhaps going up the Lawley or Care yeah. Caradoc or the, yeah. the other wonderful uh, Shropshire Hills, is that they have got this um, sort of metalled path um, so that we're not slipping too much. No, it's not too muddy because you have a bit of a tendency to fall over and I have to pretend not to laugh. <laughs> it's, not <laughs> so. it's not really a tendency, ladies and gentlemen. It, <laughs> It was once. Twice? Oh, was it twice? Yes. Oh, maybe it was once not on camera. Yeah, once oh. <laughs> Once that I will admit to, because it was on camera. The other, any other time, of course, I, complete, keep the, I, I stay completely mum about. Oh. So, this winds its way up this, this pillar. Do we know how tall it is? No. No. It's probably over a thousand feet or more, something like... 1200 but I'll probably correct myself when I found out um, but uh, we've been here several times yes and I came here I suppose just before Christmas and I remember getting to the top and phoning you and saying guess where I am and you were so annoying because you said Rodney's pillow <laughs> <laughs> oh yes I guessed it straight away right okay we will try and dodge the raindrops and make our way up it's um going to be sort of a bit wet and miserable all the time but we'll continue and wind the, our weary way around. We've got the water running off the hill here. Oops, just running off the hill as we make our way up. It's a, as Harriet said, it's, qu it's quite a, quite a trip up because it's sort of it's like um like a giant walnut whip isn't it <laughs> yeah it's <laughs> with this little pillar on yeah, the top that's quite a good description actually and um we've got beginnings now of some of the views of course if you came in um later on in the year when all the bracken is up and the trees are full of leaves you won't see quite so much of the view difficult to know where the sun is in relation to which direction we're looking but it's uh, it's amazingly flat isn't it yes it's uh, that's west isn't it it's over there so it's sort of heading back into wales yeah that way yeah yes yeah this is heading towards england <laughs> yes. at the moment but as you say we keep going around <laughs> and i don't know if you can hear this in the on the soundtrack but um, there's some shooting going on in the background maybe clay pigeon shooting it's a saturday in March as we film this and you remarked Harriet that um, the shooting season had normally finished. It has finished yes yeah, so it must be clay pigeon shooting yes. And then I said oh what sort of things do they shoot around here would it be grouse or uh, pheasant and you, you, grouse is on a moor on I didn't realise. On a moor yeah so they talk about grouse moors um, in the great grouse moors in Scotland and Yorkshire actually. Oh right okay. um, But they live in the um, 
in the heather. In the, in the heather, yeah. So actually, you get a few on top of the Longmin, for instance. Oh, like yes. Big open spaces. Yes, because um, I remember when we were at the Longmin, somebody did say we we had a grouse run yes. round, and I didn't know if it was a pheasant or a grouse, yes. and, and they actually said it's a grouse. They get them up on the Longmin. Grouse are more desirable to eat, apparently. What's her, um, Lola? <laughs> What's Lola up to? She's she's escaping. This is a very very different sort of walk to uh, the Shropshire Hills and very. the and the Sussex Downs. Yes. This must be a, a volcanic rock. I'm not sure whether it's um, granite or Precumbrian or any of those sort of geological um, bits of rock. But actually behind us here, look, you can see they've got. Uh, some stone walling, dry stone walling, covered with moss, heavily covered in moss, which is beautiful to see. We're not anywhere near the top yet. No, we're not. But we, when you look at the view, you realise that you you do actually come up quicker than you perhaps think you're walking up. Yes. Yes. There's uh, a long way to go to the top yet. Yes. <laughs> well, we'll. Um, it gets a lot steeper as well. <laughs> we will progress on. We have. A bit of snow look tucked away just it's very very mild the temperature must be about 11 or 12 and yet there is snow imagine what it was like a week ago oh yeah yeah imagine that it must have been um, horrendous up here It'd be like yeah. being in the alps or somewhere yeah. oh well the dog will eventually turn up but we're very close we're very close to the sort of turning where we then go uh, over a bit more rough ground and off this little road yes. um, but it's also close to quite um, a high precipice now I don't know whether it's I can't remember now if it's a mine uh, uh, not a mine a uh, quarry, quarry or um, whether it's a rock climbing bit that they do I think it's quarry quarry here we go madam's coming here she comes come on then you little mutt Lola say hello There we go. What's ahead look Lola? What's ahead? No, this way. Come on. Off we go. There's a little, there's a little pond down here. Have you ever been down to this pond? Uh, yeah, we did. It's the first time we came up here. I imagine this was probably an, an ice skating rink. Um, oh, it does look icy. Oh yes. On this little boardwalk. And there, as you can see, it is still frozen. Gosh. That's amazing. That's so Never once have I seen this frozen. Gosh, that looks lovely. Don't uh, go climbing on it, Lola. No. There you are. Richard will dive in after you. He won't. <laughs> that's, that's impressive, isn't it, Harriet? I'm, I'm amazed. Actually, when I went up to Cardinal Valley last week, and there's a bit of a reservoir, and that was frozen. Oh, was it? Yes, and that was after several days thaw as well. That's... This is very slippy, isn't it? Or is it just me? It's, um, well, it shouldn't be because there's some uh, yeah, there's sort of a bit yeah. of tread on it. Oh, it goes to a bit of a dead end. We've got that Carding Mill Valley walk to do, haven't we? Where we go up to the uh, the yes. waterfall. We have, have yet to do oh, that. Oh, and the reservoir. Yeah, That's, two yeah. separate ones. Oh, are they? Yes. Ah, oh, so the waterfall doesn't go into the reservoir. No. Ah, oh, okay. No, two separate walks. Yeah. Okay. Well, let's press on, shall we? Yeah, let's press on. Come on, Lola. Looks like we've um, interrupted a bunch of guys who are doing a bit of mountaineering here. Uh, they don't seem to have any energy. <laughs> and and uh, we do. We're getting the views now though. And that is the, that's the good bit. Some classic views. And then we're just climbing up this, through this sort of forest. Harriet's already got ahead of me. And so has Lola. Yes, I know, I was just taking some shots of the, of the views. Look at these wonderful moss covered um, rocks. Absolutely amazing up here. So this last bit, I'll just come this side of you if that's okay. This last bit just winds round and then we should see the pillar. Hello. Hiya. Hi. Did you ever do any mountaineering or outward bound stuff as a school child? Yes. And also volunteered at age 16 four of us girls went to the Lake District oh, really? and walked with everything on our backs from youth hostel to youth hostel. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <Think Crazy. laughs> no, you'd think no, nothing of it as a child, would you? No, no. What about now? Um, 
comfort of a nice, luxurious bed, change well, of clothes. I, I hate to say it, but I am going to the Alps and I'm hoping to do some walking like this there. Oh, right. Well, it's a bit windier now, definitely as we reach the pinnacle. Harriet. Hello. 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 It looks like um, we're there. Look at the views around us. It's amazing, isn't it? It's, it's, I always forget every time I come up here what amazing views you get and actually how high we have come. Yes. Yes, we certainly. It's, it's, it's great. It's, it's brilliant. Let's, uh, let's just have a look at some of the views and then the object of our climb, Rodney's Pillar. The rain has just decided to uh, sprinkle down on us a little bit. Some of those hilltops have got patches of snow, but it's virtually all gone. Yeah. If I sweep the camera around here, you'll see they're sticking up this edifice of stone. Yeah. It is something that you can see from miles around, isn't it? It's, it's a real landmark, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> a real landmark. There's a little viewing platform here that tells you uh, where you can see. Of course, as Harriet said earlier, we can see into England and Wales yeah. uh, at the same time. Two countries. Yeah, I know. Which is and it's amazing watching, I don't know how clear it'll be on your camera, but seeing the Severn, the River Severn, really wind its way. Yes, and that's it's sort of making its way into... Meandering. Meandering to um, Shrewsbury. Shrewsbury, yes, yeah. and then obviously eventually down to Bristol. Definitely recommend this as a walk. You can park at the bottom. As you said before, it's a uh, permitted route, yeah. permissible route. And there, Rodney's Pillar, and the landscape beyond. So thank you, Harriet, for bringing me on this incredible walk. Thank you, it's really nice, isn't we've, it? We've got more walks to do. Yeah. More of Shropshire and, as you say, Lake Vernwy and other places. But I think um, Ooh, we'll stop the now. coming in now. Because, yes, it's beginning to get colder and rainier. So yes. uh, from Harriet and I and little Lola, goodbye. Bye, see you soon.